Let's talk for a moment about the prognosis for patients diagnosed with brain tumors. And once we get through the first round of therapy of surgery and radiation and chemotherapy, what you can expect to come in the months and, and years that lay ahead. In general, the diagnosis of brain cancer is one that will need to stay active in your medical care the rest of your life. By that, I mean that you'll have a team of doctors or a particular doctor who you identify as your brain tumor doctor who will be following this. They'll be in charge of ordering the appropriate scans, modifying your therapy, counseling you about uh, what the appropriate treatment is. In patients who are doing very well, this may just be a series of MRI scans. In patients whose tumor has progressed or grown, it may mean changing therapies, either to a different form of the same therapy, a new chemotherapy, or going back to radiation or surgery in a follow-up mode. At any point when the tumor starts to grow, we revisit all of the treatment options. The other important thing to be asking your physician is to make sure that they're constantly looking for new treatments that are available. We have things available to treat patients today that weren't routinely used three or five years ago. We want to make sure that everybody's treatment is based on the most available is based on the most current data and incorporates all of new treatment options.